Hello everybody. So, as you can see, this is a Kylo Ren lightsaber. Let me turn the lights back on. Um, this is in particular for Jason. Uh, Jason, this is your lightsaber. Thank you for being so patient. Um, this lightsaber in particular seemed a little cursed, so there was a lot of stuff that I had to redo over and over and over again. And on top of that, I was making a soundboard do something that it wasn't originally intended to do. But, hey, I got it to work. So, without further ado, uh, let's talk about the saber. It is a Kylo Ren Disney uh, Black Series FX, um, but only on the outside. Uh, the blades have been removed. Uh, these are red day blades, so uh, it always is going to be red, even if you're carrying it out during the day. Um, the entire internals have been gutted, and they are now, it is now running uh, uh, red, red, white, tri Cree uh, for the main blade, two red Crees for the side blades, uh, one each, and. It is powered by the best lightsaber soundboard out there on the market, the Crystal Focus. This is an earlier Crystal Focus. It's a Crystal Focus that has been flashed uh, to the most current firmware, uh, 5.11. So, let's go ahead and open it up. Um, so, what I did uh, mainly to make this saber unique, uh, and unlike any other that I've seen is it's got a full 3D printed crystal reveal chassis um, on uh, a Hasbro or not a Hasbro, a Black Series FX Saber. Um, so let's go ahead and open it up. You've got this is also going to serve as Jason's instructional video, so it's going to be a little bit long winded, but this is all information for Jason. So, Jason, you've got three main screws um, that you will use to uh, expose the chassis where you'll find your recharge port, you'll find your SD card so you can change settings. Um, I'll get, email you the factory settings as well as the current settings. So if any mistakes are made, you can always revert back to the original. Um, as well, I'll send you the PDF file explaining everything uh, as far as feature-wise that the Crystal Focus 5.11 is capable of doing. So, to get to the insides, to open her up, you've got three button head screws. Uh, you've got the one right here and these two on the sides. The, all three of them don't need to be taken out completely. You don't need to. You can, but you don't need to. You just loosen them to about a quarter of an inch, um, maybe an eighth of an inch uh, for all three, and the back end of the lightsaber will slide off, like so. Get it to balance here and still be in the frame. So, I'm going to zoom in just a little bit. Bear with me, folks. So, there's your exposed crystal focus. Uh, the crystal right up here on top, your crystal focus. I even did some red, a single red wire running through the soundboard. So, just as a fun little aesthetic. You have your X SD card access right here. Um, on the back side, we'll flip it over. You have your recharge port. The kill key is the twist style, so it's safe for you to leave this uh, kill key inside and just turn it to restore power to the saber. When you need to charge it, you'll need to pull the kill, kill key completely out. It also has a red LED indicating that power is to the board. It's just a safety thing. So let's go ahead and turn it back over. So hit my light. It has been an awakening. Have you felt it? Yes. 
I did a, custom, a couple of custom scroll patterns for the LEDs. Uh, it's going to be hard to pick it up on camera because they're so super close together and they're super tiny. Um, so it's going to be a little harder to pick them up with the scroll pattern on camera on this video. So I'm going to zoom out just a little bit. Go ahead and center the camera. And we'll put this back on, but we're just going to hand tighten it. So. It doesn't fall off while I'm showing the features. So this Zaber is loaded with six sound banks. The boot font that you just heard um, was one that was chosen by you specifically uh, because you really liked that sound font that I or that boot sound that was on the previous Saber. So that signifies that you are in your Kylo Ren uh, sound font. Uh, I put five other Sith font, uh, fonts on here, so it's all completely dark side. Dark side rules, uh, and then uh, the full soundtrack to The Force Awakens as well in your saber tracks. So, without further ado, let's go ahead and light this puppy up. You have two buttons here, and you have your main activation switch, which is going to be the black button, and you have a brown button just a little bit above it, which is going to be your auxiliary button. Um, your auxiliary button is going to be used to activate uh, blaster blocks, force moves, um, all the different features in the Crystal Focus. Uh, as I said before, I'll have you go through the uh, manual so you know each and everything that the Crystal Focus is capable of. So, let's go ahead and boot it up. So... Got your staggered ignition, nice bright blade, um, blaster deflex. Couple of uh, force moves. Um, it responds to the the pitch and shift of the lightsaber very well. It's very sensitive, um, so it's a great piece overall. Um, let's go ahead and scroll or shut this one off and show you one of the old or other sound points. That's and now we're in our main menu. To get into the main menu, you'll press and hold your auxiliary auxiliary button. Um, and that will give you a beep and you go into your menu where you can select your sound font. To scroll through the sound font, you just tap the button uh, and it'll go to the next sound font. At last we will reveal ourselves to the Jedi. At last we will have revenge. That's our Darth Maul font. Korriban, one of my favorites. Vader. All right, let's play some Vader. So it sounds very distinctly like Darth Vader's lightsaber. Uh, with the red blade, it's kind of hard to see the flash on Clash, but with the white blade, it's very, uh, you've already seen it, it's a very bright white flash on Clash. We'll go back into the menu. And that is your eye saber or your music track player. So we're going to go ahead and go into that. Press and hold to select. So, 
to exit iSaber, press and hold. And that's it. So, that's your lightsaber. Um, I hope you like it. Oh, I forgot one very important thing. So, let's go ahead and zoom in real close. This compartment I can do it gently enough. <laughs> Opens up. Let me turn off that light. There is an exposed crystal. Oh, it's kind of hard to see. The red light is really bright and kind of flooding it out. But there is an exposed LED right there in the center that pulses with the main blade. It's right there. Well, Jason, I hope you like your saber. It is the last of the Kylo Ren's that I will ever do. So, as they say, May the force be with you.